Welcome to Shy Sense 773. Thank you so much for checking out my video. For those checking out my video for the first time, I just wanna say welcome in. Thank you so much for viewing my video. If you could like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, I would truly appreciate it. For those that have been here the whole time and my new subscribers, I just wanna say welcome in and thank you so much for your subscription, for your likes, for your comments. They really do go a long way. So today's video is on a place that I went to. So it was a perfume bar that I'd never heard of. I was actually in the Schomburg area and decided to go to Woodfield Mall. And while walking around, I ran into this place and I was so surprised. So let me show you a little bit of that in this B-reel right quick. So I just found out about this awesome perfume bar that they just put up. This is in Whitfield Mall, Schomburg. Shout out to my guys right here. They have this amazing setup. So what they do is they actually mix everything for you in person. If you are in the Woodfield area, if you are in Schaumburg, come to Woodfield Mall. They are right in front of Bath and Body Works. My man is mixing up two fragrances that I purchased right now. Review will be coming very, very soon. They have a nice setup over here. All of the bottles. These are inspired expressions. Such a great setup. Some quick behind the scenes. Looking at all of the decants of oil. It's mixing up the ingredients currently. This is a must experience. Okay, so now you checked out that video. It was it was so cool actually going to the place and talking to the master perfumer. His name is Ali. And honestly, it was the first time I had ever seen that besides at uh, Leila Bo. So Leila Bo typically does that, but this place was absolutely cool. Um, the guys were very cool as well, talking to me about scents, about fragrances, and then asking me to kind of smell some of the stuff that they had, and it was pretty good quality. I'll have to be honest with you, uh, a lot of their fragrances that they had that were inspired expressions actually smelled like inspired expressions of, um, or they smelled pretty, pretty close to the original. Um, a couple in particular that I was in love with was their Mojave Ghost. That actually smelled very good. Uh, they, of course, had a Baccarat Rouge like every other place does as well. So they had their rendition. And then there was a Joe Malone fragrance that blew my mind. So that's the first fragrance that I want to talk about. So the name of the place is called Yum and Lael. And some of the bottles look like this. So as you see, it's a little print magnet. But this is just like a normal... A uh, bottle that you can actually buy. I actually have decant bottles like this. But as you saw when the master mixer was actually mixing the fragrance, this is the fragrance he was mixing. And this one is called uh, Mukarats M Emirates, something like that. I'll actually put the name of it in the description below. But uh, let's talk about this one. This is the one I was talking about, the Oud and Bergamot. This one smells so good to me. So I'm gonna spray this on. I don't have anything on my arm right now. 
and wow, it smells so beautiful. Uh, just like the Jo Malone fragrance, this one actually sits pretty light, but it lasts pretty long on skin. So I'm getting about six to eight hours of longevity. It's not overpowering at all. I get this beautiful bergamot and it almost smells woody as well, but it's very, very sexy. Um, I truly enjoy this. If you get a chance to, like I said, you can go to this bar. Uh, they actually have two locations that I found out about. So there is another location in Rosemont and it's at the Fashion Chicago Outlet. So you can actually go in that mall and they have the same exact setup there. So for my people that are from Chicago or that are actually visiting, go and visit this place. They are, they have some amazing scents that you can put together. And at a price point, so these are $70 for the 100 mil and then the 50 mil was $45. The other fragrance that I picked up, this one, like I said before, this one is so beautiful. So this reminds me of Oud Silk Mood uh, from MFK. And it smells so close to me. Like it's very, very sexy. Of course, I know the Oud is not as smooth as the Oud in Oud Silk Mood but it still has those same qualities. I would say this is about 90% close. Uh, it's very smooth. It's not overpowering, but then the cool part about it is that it's not a linear scent. So this actually dries down to a lavender kind of woody based fragrance, which I absolutely love. So you're getting like that you're getting that rose oud at first, and then the fragrance breaks down, and then it goes into this bomb lavender fragrance that I'm just like, wow. I've actually been wearing this for the past couple of days, just so I can get some good wearings on it. And this one also lasts about six to eight hours as well, but it's a very, very beautiful fragrance, honestly. You should go over to that place that I said again, that's in the mall. I don't know where it's located in the Chicago Outlet Mall, but definitely in Woodfield Mall. It's right next to the Bath and Body Works. Very, very beautiful fragrances. Ali, you and your company knock these out. I'll definitely be over there to visit you soon. Thank you guys so much for checking out my video. I really do appreciate it. And until the next video, have a blessed day and take care.